Hi this is Amit from Digital Inspiration and in today's episode I'll show you a new way to set up automatic responders in Gmail using a Google add-on. Gmail doesn't have a built-in auto response feature but they have something called canned responses. So if I go to my Gmail settings, labs and enable canned responses, what I can do is I can write a message and save it in my drafts. And the next time I need to respond to someone using that common message, I can simply pull that message from my canned response drafts and reply with one click thus saving a lot of keystrokes. So let me show you a quick demo. So let's say someone has sent you an event invite and you would like to politely decline that invite. Now we'll use canned responses for that. So I'll create a new draft and write my message and save that as a canned response. And now that the draft has been saved as a canned response, I can open any email message inside Gmail and easily pull that canned response into the current reply. So you've seen we have saved so much time and we could reply to an email within a second but there are two big limitations with this uh, approach. The biggest limitation is that you cannot respond to multiple messages in one go. So for instance I cannot select more than one email and ask Gmail to reply to all those messages using a particular canned response. I will have to do that one by one manually. The other problem is that canned responses are not available in the mobile apps of Gmail. So if you're checking your email on Android or iOS devices, you cannot apply canned responses. You will have to write the responses manually in those email clients. So as a workaround, we can use the Google add-on based Gmail autoresponder that has all the functionality of uh, canned responses, but it works on mobile too and you can even uh, autorespond to multiple messages in one go. So let's start with an example itself. I will move this message to a new label. Uh, let's call this message auto response in event decline. So by looking at the label name itself, I know that this all messages under this label have to reply it with the event decline uh, canned response. Now I'll switch to my Google Sheet and I've already installed the email autoresponder add-on. You can find the link to download this in the show notes. So I'll go to the add-ons menu and under email autoresponder I'll create a new role. Here we'll create a very simple rule that any email messages that have a particular Gmail label they should be autoresponded with a particular draft message. So I'll select the Gmail label from the drop-down as well as the Gmail draft template from the drop-down. Now by default all these replies are sent with your default Gmail address but if you have multiple email accounts connected to your Gmail account you can choose any of those email accounts from this drop down. Next I'll click the create rule button to activate this rule and what will happen now is that this add-on will run in the background. It will connect to your Gmail account every one hour and if there are any matching messages it will auto respond to those messages using the corresponding draft messages. Now let's try creating a more advanced rule. So I'll go to my Gmail mailbox and create another draft. Now this is uh, just like any other Gmail message. So I can include attachments, images, I can even format the text. Once the draft is created, I switch to the Google Sheet to create a new rule. Now if you remember previously we had a very simple rule that if messages belong to a particular Gmail label or folder, you can auto respond to them with a particular draft. Now this time we will set up a more advanced rule. So in this example, let's say we want to create a rule where all messages that are inbox, that are unread and that are received in the last two days and that have particular words in the message body, I only want to send an uh, auto response to those messages. So what I can use is all the Gmail search operators I can use to create my advanced criteria. So all the rules are running in the background now, they will check your emails every one hour and if any matching emails are found, they will auto respond to them using the corresponding draft messages. Now there can be situations when you cannot wait that long and you want to run a rule instantly. So for that go to the add-ons menu again and choose manage rules. Here choose the rule that you want to run manually from the drop down and hit the run button to instantly uh, respond to those matching messages.
the Gmail auto responder will uh, log every activity in the Google Sheet itself so you know what's happening behind the scenes and if you go to your Gmail inbox to look at the respondent message you will see that a new label called responded has been applied to those messages and that purely indicates that a response has been sent by the auto responder so in the next iteration it will simply skip this message. I hope you find Gmail autoresponder useful and do visit my website controlq.org for more Google scripts and tips. Thanks.